Sure, I got inspired by travel posters from the 50s, and our favorite destination in our minds was Buenos Aires. A combination of um, European and Latin sensibilities, it's of course known as the Paris of South America, and that really inspired the whole collection. They, she was so international, uh, so chic, and um, sensual but tailored at the same time. They make women look feminine and feel beautiful and that's what I love about them. Each piece is artisanally made, is individual, is, is one of a kind. I think it keeps it modern, it's that combination that I think it's nice. It's not just vintage, vintage, vintage. People always say the little black dress is a must have and I think this season we really have the little black dress that is the real must have. It's very different from her past shows. I like it. I've always wanted to just throw a big party. Well, a lot of beautiful sleeves. The colors are a gradient of like pale pink up to like a hot orange. And then the same thing with like pale blue to hot turquoise. There's just a hit of color on the eyes to give it that sort of the artsy girl goes to a, an art opening kind of look. And that sort of low side part, which I love. What brings me here to see the show and to wear this cool outfit? We started with the idea that this girl takes her boyfriend's shirt and wears it as a dress and layer this kind of iconic biker jacket and all the pieces on top of it. The palette was very black and white, the silhouette is, is a little bit uh, playing with new volumes, construction. So she's definitely playing into the masculine but there's a lot of injection of more delicate touches like with the macrame and embroideries and more feminine things. So this idea of denim uh, in a very abstract way overall is such a denim board workwear item, but to then transform it into tailored wool or leather gave it a whole new identity. Diesel you think of for jeans and more kind of your everyday stuff, so this is where they kind of get to jazz it up and really go fashion. 